therefore him saying that was racist. Oh, Jesus Christ. Obviously, it's no sense talking to you. You're a moron. You heard me? You're an absolute moron. Well, this is another episode of Taking Out the Garbage. And then, of course, this is only a fraction of uh, the crap I put up with out there because, you know, as I say, a lot of them are just drive-by insults and uh, too quick to go ahead and get the cameras on or they don't stop long enough for me to truly engage them. So it, it gets it gets strange out there, I'll tell you. On a given weekend, I'm putting up with a lot of bullshit. So what do I do? I share it with you guys. You get to share the bullshit too. Oh, God. I don't know how it's going to end, man. But I don't think it's going to end pretty. I... I the tension keeps on rising. They get more, more strange as the day goes by. And if this impeachment thing goes through, they're going to get even weirder. If it doesn't go through, they're going to get even weirder. Oh, God. Well, you know what to do. Pray for me. <laughs> I'm on the front lines out there. Uh, and if you can contribute, you know, you know all the right buttons to hit. Hopefully I'll have a shop up here one of these days back up. But I mean, I'm so damn busy lately. I haven't been able to be able to scratch my ass. So. So. Here we go. I'll see you on the flip end of this. In Canada, there's three parties. So there's what we call the Republicans, is called the Conservatives, the Democrats is called the NDP, National Democratic Party, and then there's one in the middle, the Liberal, and that's Justin Trudeau's party, which I'm in so, favor of because it's Justin Trudeau, the guy who dresses in blackface, the hypocrite. Well, I know you can. People made a big deal out of that. He was a silly 20 year old or whatever. No, no, no. He was in college, and then he, know, it's six times. 20. Six. I'm not going to argue with you. I'm not ever going to. Six times. I hate that man. Why? Because he's a fool and he's a fake. How's he a fool? He's a fake. How's he a fake? He's only for himself. How's he? What do you mean? Why place. would he? Why would he do this if he was doing know, it for this himself? Whole country, this whole corner of the country can can believe that guy's going to make a difference and help. He's already made a difference. No, he hasn't. He's the, the, the people I'm speaking to are lying to me. Yeah, I think so. Oh, really? Can maybe you can explain this to me? The liberals were at his rally last night outside the rally, waving the communist Chinese flag. Now, you in Hong Kong, they're waving the American flag. Can you explain that discrepancy no, to me? No. They don't know I the don't details. Know all the answers. I only know that guy is. They don't know the details in Hong Kong? I can't believe anybody. Of what? Him. What don't they know the details of? A big mistake to keep him going. What don't they know the details of, sir? Sorry? What don't they know the details of? They don't know the details in Hong Kong. Of they what? Just, they just believe in, in America as a great country, which it is, and, and that's all they know. They don't know the details behind it. Well, how do you know what they know? Well, I've been there. Have you been there? No, but have I mean, you, you, so you, you have an idea. You've got, you have know you, what they all think. I've talked to enough have, have, Chinese people been, out uh, here. I have one question. Have you been out of the country? Oh, yes. Where? Where? Uh, Central and South America. Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay. Enjoy. Oh have fun. How you doing? You're from Mexico. You're from Mexico? Oh yeah. Oh good. I'm Mexican American. Oh wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. Born here, but a Mexican American. Oh good. Yeah. Wonderful. Well. Yeah. I'm not a fan of the guy, but. Why not? I just don't like him at all. Why? I have no reason to explain. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. No, that's just my reason. I have oh no my reason. God, I love it. Look at it. Love like it. to leave anything in the bulletproof vest fund? <laughs> Now I'm in like the corner. Look at 
Unless you're, you want to read the sign, see the sign. And now I'm going to go in there. Not a mooching liberal, are you? Uncle Sam, how you doing? Pardon? No, Speaking that guy. Probably was a mooch liberal. Of course they are. I love it. Chuck, you already have that hat. I like, I like the little... We already have our sign. Yeah. All right, are you going in there? I even got a magnet that's sticking on my refrigerator. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you don't look like any snowflake I've ever seen. No, sure. No, I didn't think so. <laughs> I'm not a disgusting uh, communist elitist that, yeah. that considers 95% of people are idiots, and I need to pass a law to control everybody. Amazing. We live out in Oregon. The uh, company I work for is a log truck company. One of our guys, every time he does a uh, trip to Washington, has to go through Portland. He puts a big Trump 2020 sign on the door. He goes right through Portland. I <laughs> love it. <laughs> I say, fuck it, let's go back and kill them all. Hey, I, you know, I'm a, they want to have a fight. We got the guns. Let's go. I got no problem doing it for the fans. Uh, well, that's how, you know, I, Thomas Jefferson said it. From time to time, the tree of liberty must be watered by the blood of patriots and tyrants. He suggested about once every 20-odd years. We're well overdue. Oh, oh yeah. And, you know... People keep saying, like, oh, who's going to be the ones to go take the guns, the uh, the military and the police? Like, Do you think what, yeah, when I was in the military, if they would have told me that, I'm like, yeah, no, I'm not doing that. I must have <laughs> asked 50, if I asked one policeman out here, if they give the orders to take our guns well, before I can get this, oh, ain't Lord. doing it. <laughs> Why would I have a lock them up one? Why would I have a lock them up one? Oh my God. I mean, the stock market went up 500 points today because it made a deal with China. Are you upset at that? Are you upset over that? No, I'm just upset about his language and his attitude. And so it's a style. It's a style you're worried about. The fact that. And what lying? Give me a lie. Give me one lie. That he had more people at his inauguration. He than did, darling. <laughs> Would you like me to draw up the pictures? I have them on the TV back there. Would you like me to show you the, the pictures? No, I have pictures too. Yeah, I, would you like to compare pictures? I talked to people over there that couldn't hardly get in because there were so many people. Would you like to go ahead and, and compare that up? I mean, have you ever gone to see him? No, but I was at Obama's inauguration. Yeah, yeah. Well, last night when he had his uh, uh, rally, the, there were 20,000 people inside the arena, 25,000 people outside the arena. What this is coming to is you're trying to convince me of something I'm never going to believe, and I'm trying to convince Yeah, because you haven't got anything to back it up. As I said, the, you know, all you're worried about is style. The man's got... I talk to people out here every day that have small businesses, can't find people to work. They're jobs. Yet, you know, the liberals don't want to have those jobs. They rather sit home and let the government give them something. Oh, no, that's not... Oh, really? Then how come they won't go get those jobs, lady? Why are you such a bully? <laughs> well, because idiots like you come up. Oh, this is my wife. I don't appreciate that. Okay. Okay. Well, then will you, you stand up you for it? Why don't you tell me? Why don't you stand up? Why don't you tell me? Whatever I want. Why don't you tell me why they were anything. waving communist flags outside the protest last night? Waving communist flags. Have a good day. How come they were waving communist flags outside of that rally last night? Huh? You don't care that the liberals are waving communist flags. You don't care about that, huh? You love the taxes there, don't you? I'm sorry, I have no patience with these morons. It's over, bud. Or I, I actually forgot about what we were doing. <laughs> <laughs> so did I. I just... Oh, I, uh, great, when, great. A, when a fight comes along, that takes pride. I'll tell you what, I like your style there, sir. I like your style. Uh, you don't like our president? No. You don't like our president? Yeah, but no. Why don't you like our president? <laughs> Same reason he don't like blacks. <laughs> he doesn't like blacks? How well? How, why prove that to me? He's stupid. How's he stupid, you moron? Give me an example. Both of you. See, you, you guys got nothing. You got nothing. Nothing. Collectively, your IQ doesn't reach room temperature. You couldn't argue with me if your life depended on it, you morons. Argument from a dumb liberal. Yeah, now let me ask you, what do you got against, man, that he lowered black unemployment to the lowest in history? 
What do you got against that? Because his rhetoric, the way he speaks about people of color, is disgusting. How, give me an example. Give me an example. When he said that Barack Obama wasn't born in the United States. Well, That's I can one give, person. I can give you That's that. one person. I can, one. Wait, 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 wait. Before you go yeah, anywhere. You asked me a question. I answered you. Wait, before you go anywhere. Okay. I want you to do this. Yes, sir. I mean, are you, have you ever opened enough Don't mind? Don't point that in my face. This is a microphone. I'll point anywhere I want. I'm going to... Yes, sir. I'll point this way I want to as well. All right. Again, if you want to be an asshole, be an asshole. You're Are you going to listen well. to me or what? Speak then. All right. If you want, if you got an open enough mind, all right? I do. There's a documentary by an award-winning journalist. It's called Dreams from My Real Father that shows the undocumented uh, history of Barack Obama. I would beg you to watch it. Okay. Because in there it shows, and if you watch it, it shows who his real father was. It shows that, that man was. is an ignorant ass. Yes, oh, Barack Obama was born in the United States. And the thing that, that, that he that, said is nonsense. He may have been the born of the United States. And so therefore, him saying that was racist. Mm, Jesus Christ. Hey, Obviously, it's no sense talking to you. You're a moron. You heard me? You're an absolute moron. You're a moron. You are a moron, sir. You are a moron. And you're a racist ass. You are a complete moron. Don't call me badass Uncle Sam for nothing. <laughs> Prejudice, you. you're the bigot. I heard you. You're the bigot. I heard you. You are the bigot, sir. Okay. You are the bigot. Fuck you, piece of shit. You. Piece you're a vulgar shit. and you're shit. a bigot. You're vulgar and you're a bigot. And you're an asshole. And a, I, you're I, a vulgar and you're a bigot. And you're an asshole. A racist asshole. You don't know, you even know my history, you moron. You don't know my history, you moron. You're a moron! And you're vulgar! Like the Donald? No, it'll, uh, she's not a fan. What can I say? Why, why don't you like the Donald? Oh, he's, the Donald. You know, he said things. I just, nice. I don't think he's a nice person. You don't think he's a nice person? Yeah, I don't want to argue with you. You know, every person I've ever spoken to that has had personal contact with him. Personal contact? Personal contact yeah. with him has said he is a real guy. He's, I would he's say nice, that. he's real. Well, except for the women that he um, attacked. And, and the, the, again, it, it, that, it, that'd be total bullcrap. Because again, the women I've talked to that work with him yeah. saying he's a perfect gentleman. Yeah. So again, the stuff you hear in the news I think is like bullshit. <laughs> And, you know, that gets repeated over and over again, and the people take the wrong, uh, get a wrong impression. But the people that have personal contact with him say he is a nice man. Well, I'm glad they had good experiences. That's good. Yeah, well, I mean, I've never met him. Some. I'm sure he's a nice guy. Those two aren't a big fan, but I voted for him. All right. <laughs> oh, you big man. You a big man. You a big man. Bigger and smarter than you, baby. You big man. You you you're big man. You're big man. You're big man. You're big man. Big man. Big man. Big man. Hey, oh, I made you smile. Oh, who's not gonna laugh at that? Who's not gonna laugh at that? I'm from Kentucky, so I like your style. You got a lot of fun. I am. You're a lot of fun. Why don't you like the Donald? Tell me why don't you like I'm it. I'm not talking to you. The fuck? Okay. Let's go on. We don't, we don't talk to mother. Look, you are not rational. God bless you. Well, how do you know that? You aren't even talking to me. You're not even talking to me. How do you know what I am? You're the one that's vulgar. You're the one that's vulgar. I'm not rational, but you're the vulgar one. That's beautiful. to talk, but you won't. I won't. You won't talk. All you do is shoot the finger and be vulgar. That's all you'll do. All 
I'm telling you, huh? Still blaming her on this for all of his mistakes. <laughs> what what mistakes is that, sir? Get my, get my picture. Uh, it's there, what there. mistake does that? Oh, yeah. it's the uh, yeah. health, yeah. everything, everything from the health care law to the impeachment process, he blaming her for it. Three years, three years in this presidency. I mean, I mean, she lost the presidency. She'll never run again. Why does he bother? Thank goodness. Well, uh, well, I think her? I think it's because the yeah, criminality, like, thirty-five yeah. years of criminality that have been, uh, you oh. know, attributed. Oh shit! Yeah. I mean, you can't argue. I with think. Them. I think. But can I ask you this, sir? If you're like as being a, as being a liberal, can I ask you this? Are you proud of this that left wingers attack? Uh, Trump supporters as they were leaving the rally the other night. Are you proud of that, sir? Well, if I was a left winger, I'd have probably done the same thing. I mean, they dumb enough to support So you Trump are okay <laughs> with violence then against your opponents? <laughs> I'm not okay. I'm not are okay you okay with, with violence okay against with, your opponents? I'm not okay with violence. Trump seemed to be okay with violence. We're not talking to you. Okay. Then you show me the no, articles, no, sir, no, where people were attacked. <laughs> Where Trump's, you know, where Trump's uh, uh, attacked uh, any Democrats. Could you show me that article, sir? He he supported the right. Uh, can you show me any articles where Trump supporters attacked left wingers anywhere? Can you show me that? It was all over TV. I don't. Uh, know about can you articles. show me that, sir? You, you, I don't carry him around, and you know it. So that, you're, this is okay with you? That that big. Fat, is this okay thing? with you that you Moron. got you got people attacking and spitting on people as they leave a rally? Is that okay with you? Well, no, but it's, it's not okay with me that the right wingers do it to the left wingers. Show so. me where that's being done, sir. <laughs> Show you where it's being done. It was all over Show TV. Show me all over, all TV. over TV. Yeah, bullshit. 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 I'm tall and bullshit on you, sir. Yeah. Total bullshit. Let's keep Let's shopping. Go. Let's go shopping. How about this, sir? How about you want to talk about corruption? Uh, How about Joe Biden bragging about, uh, you know, Ukraine fired a prosecutor investigating his son's company. That's what, on TV, Biden bragging about bribing the Ukraine to fire the prosecutor. That, that's a bunch of bullshit written on a page. Hey. It's on TV. Would you like to see the video? No. Would you like to see him saying it? Would you like to see it? His own video. I don't, no, I don't need to see it. I know it. Uh, you don't need to see it. I understand you don't need to see it. Uh -huh. It's okay. That's, we've been married two months, and that's the only disagreement we have. I'm a trumpeter. I don't think it's going to last. All right. So, uh, this is me taking off to take care of some personal business. So I figure I leave the cameras on to see what happens when I'm not there to tend the cart. And uh, <laughs> it's just a little thing. I watch this sleepy little thing, right? Watch how gleeful she is about what? Strangling an inanimate object. <laughs> Uh, I'm telling you, I, I I don't know what to say. I don't think things are going to turn out too well. Uh, these people are not sane. And uh, if indeed their impeachment thing fails and Trump wins, we're going to see them go over the edge because they're I mean they're cornered rats and on the flip side of that if they wind up pulling off their coup we're going to be pushed over the edge so one way or the other I don't know pray pray hard And uh, God bless you. See you guys on the streets.